night gave them any indication that anything bizarre was about to take place. No, nothing, nothing is unusual. I mean, last night we kissed goodnight. Michael and a workmate started to search at the local railway stations. Nothing. So much news. The police came back and said a young man had been fatally injured in a hit and run last night. Would the Murrays come to Glebe Morgue for a possible identification? The police thought the victim was around 20 and Jason was only 14, but it was another avenue that was essential to explore. The drive to the morgue was the longest of Lydia and Michael's lives. The previous night, about 20 past 10, a motorist driving north... Lydia and Michael officially identified the unknown hit-run victim as their son, Jason. Jason Murray died from a combination of chest and abdominal injuries. What we now want to know is how and why. Mr. Drury, the story that Sergeant Rogerson... Yes. Uh, well, he rang me at work and then walked up to see me. So, he rang you? Perfectly straightforward. I'd sent a message to Dr. Any mention made during that conversation of any sum of money? No. Uh, there was no sum mentioned to me, and I definitely didn't mention any money to Detective Drury. In particular, uh, was mention made of a sum of money, 15 to 25,000? Definitely not. Was there anything whatever improper about the conversation you had with Drury? No. Your fellow officers, Perrin and... ...asked you about the death of Jack Richardson. Yes. You have a strong personality? That would be the case. You are... Not guilty, Your Honour. Don't you worry, you'll pay in some way. That's a funny retard! I don't! What do you think about the verdict, Detective Drury? 